Hi, my name is Betsy. Uh, I'm from Elka. Uh, we are a 1974 company uh, in Taiwan. And currently, we have uh, different multiple sites like Taiwan, Dongguan, and Laos, Malaysia, and Indonesia. Just so, for the manufacturing? Yes, so we can provide a uh, different side of production and also uh, provide a TAA compliant cable for the government project. So for example, you do a uh, optical? Yes. And what is this cable, for example? This is uh, HDMI AKLC cable and it's pure, uh, not pure fiber, but it's hybrid uh, with copper and optical inside uh, the cable. And we can have a uh, different material uh, like PVC, TPE, TPU, uh, silicone. So yeah. this is just a plastic cover there? Uh, and uh, it's, yes. it's high quality materials inside? Yes. Oh. Yes. It's 24K gold plated. Yeah. So there's a very excellent signal in there for the full HDMI 2.1. Yeah. And 30 meters. Yeah, we can make up to 30 meters. And this one is our pure fiber active optical extender. Yeah, it's zinc uh, zinc olic shell. Yeah, as well as 24K gold plated. So what connector. is happening here? This USB. Yes, this USB is for power. Yeah, because some of the uh, TV or source side, uh, the power is not enough to boost up uh, the. Uh, the 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 the, um, the, the projection. Whole, they yeah. are the yeah. The whole cable. So so you add the power. Yeah, we from, add uh, power with to the avoid power adapter. the power. Yes. All right. You just put the power adapter next to the TV. Yes. And it's fully powered, and it's stable. It can be very long. Yeah, and it's up to 300 meters. So it's like a decision. Uh, customer can use uh, their own MPO, or we can supply MPO as well then they can uh, just click and then uh, make a decision to make the uh, cable more 300 longer. meters. Yes, up to 300 meters. It's like 1,000 feet or something, it's yes. pretty much. Yes. All right. Okay, and this one is USB-C to HDMI AK adapter cable. Uh, because uh, currently there are more and more uh, interface are made by Type-C. So we make a Type-C and transfer to HDMI. Yeah. And it is also made by aluminum case. And uh, how long is going to be uh, working, this cable? Uh, currently, it's 1.8 meter, but we are developing uh, 3 meter. Yeah. And for how many years will be good? Uh, I think uh, in quarter three. Yeah, in the third quarter. Ah, third quarter. Yeah. But uh, if I buy it now, if I buy it in quarter three, I'll be able to keep it for 10 years. Uh, it sure, will never sure. break. Yes, never, never break. break. Yeah, yeah. And we also uh, make by uh, the nylon braided. Yeah, it can make uh, the cable more durable. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And this one is uh, the current latest. Uh, Specification of HDMI is 2.1, yeah, and we can make up to 7.62 meters, yeah, and it's passive. Passive. Yeah, the most longest uh, cable. So how do you make such a long passive cable? Yeah, you, you have can, a good construction. The yeah, copper? you can see uh, the thickness and OD is much bigger than the usual. Uh, HDMI cable, yeah. All right. Yeah. Some people still want the passive. Yes, correct. Is it cheaper a little bit? Yes, it's cheaper. Uh, around, uh, for example, for this one, maybe it's up to fifty dollars, uh, even uh, even thousand dollars. Yeah, by customer. How much you say? Yeah, thousand. Fifth, one thousand. Yeah. I mean, because some of customer would like to use different uh, material for their uh, for their cable and also based on their brand, uh, yeah. Their but what does it start at? What is the minimum price? Uh, the minimum price is around 30, 30. 50, yes. 30, 50. Yes. So it's all the range from 30, 50 to, yes. to 1,000? To 1,000, But yeah. this one is can be less. Uh, yeah, could be 10, only 10 or maybe 8. 
Yeah. All right. Yeah. And this one is our active cable. Uh, we made uh, the chipset by our own self. Yeah. What is this chipset? Uh, we name it August. Yeah, you can see. Like July, August, September? No. Uh, it's a Greek uh, mythology. You can see that. Oh. Argus. Argus. Yes. All right. Yeah. We uh, are the first one company to uh, develop uh, active cable. And we can have different lengths from 7.5 meters to 12 meters. Yeah. First active cable? Yeah. All right. This is copper active cable. What does that mean? Yeah. Uh, it's uh, we use uh, the structure of passive cable, but we put the chipset in front of the connector uh, to boost up the lens. So it's yeah. like a, it's like a ADSL internet over the copper lines. Mm -hmm. It's like a. It's still a copper cable. Yeah, but yeah. it's different kind, different in way of different sending way, the signal. Yeah, yeah, and different with the AOC. So it, that means you can do longer cable, more stable cables, yes. even without the optical. Yes, correct. All right. And how's the price with this kind of solution? Uh, it's almost the same as AOC. Yeah, because copper is much more uh, expensive. Yeah, and also yeah. Uh, the chipset, the module, uh, usually uh, more expensive. It's around twenty-five to thirty dollars. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So what would be the market for this one? Uh, for installation. So yeah. where they don't want to use optical for yes. some reasons. Yes, because some of customers would think uh, the AOC is not much more stable. Yeah, okay. So maybe they would like to use the copper one. Yeah. All right. All right. Okay. And what do we have here? Yeah, this is 4K wireless display HDMI uh, high speed expander. Uh, because uh, during the COVID, uh, many companies provide uh, their own material system. And we also uh, develop our own uh, wireless extender. Uh, you can use this uh, one transmitter and one receiver uh, with your device, and then uh, transmit your uh, PowerPoint, your material to the monitor directly. And only uh, you can press uh, one, yeah, pair, and reset then your material will zoop, go to the monitor. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Is it using gigahertz? Uh, five gigahertz. Five yeah. gigahertz? Yes, yeah. through a Wi-Fi. And you can have six devices at the same time. So it's yeah. the same place like Wi-Fi spectrum? Yes. So you do a lot of compression? Uh, no. No? No, no. Yeah. No need no, a no lot need. of compression? Yes, yes. And it's low latency and also uh, uh, the low power consumption, yeah. So no need to do it in 60 gigahertz or something like that? No, no need. And it can up to 4K, 30 hertz. But uh, recently, uh, the popular extender you can buy from the market is only support uh, 1080p. 1080p. Yeah, yeah. So but you have we 4K, can 30. To, yeah, we have 4K, 30. Can you work on the 4K, 60? Uh, not yet. Not yet. Yeah, not yet. Yeah. All right. Is it expensive technology to have this? Uh, for one pair, uh, one transmitter and one receiver is about seventy dollars. All right. Yeah. yeah. And also, we develop uh, the Type C connector uh, for the customer whose laptop and notebook with uh, Type C interface. Nice. Yeah. There you have a wireless signal yes, to the wireless HDMI signal. receiver. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And you can uh, use it uh, in twenty meter distance. Yeah, it's quite large. Nice. This is a Type C uh, adapter. Dango, yes. Yeah. Dango. Yeah, Dango. Uh, it's eight uh, in one. We have Type C PD for charging, and HDMI uh, for uh, yeah, the display, and also Ethernet, and you can use uh, ESD card. What is your chipset in there? Oh. No need to ask. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. No problem. <laughs> Secret. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And also, uh, yeah, this is for data. Five gigabit. Yeah. And USB A. Yeah. So it's a three point one adapter, maybe. Uh, eight point one. Yeah. This eight, one is eight point one. Yeah. Uh, but yeah. USB three point one, maybe spec four. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah. So the, okay. here's some of your golden logos. You have uh, AK three hundred yeah, meters. Meter. 
all the support. Yeah. HDMI 2.1 support. Yes. Correct. And you've been uh, collaborating uh, with the HDMI since the beginning? Yes. Many, many years? Yes, many years. Yes. All right. We are the adapter uh, of the HDMI forum. Uh, can you say something about the market share? Are you one of the top? Uh, I can't say that, <laughs> but uh, most of our company sales uh, come from, 5 uh, percent is from uh, United States. So um, I can say that uh, the active cable in the United States, there are around 70% are made by Elka. Yeah. 